What is going on guys? It is Josh coming at you with another video. Thank you guys for clicking on the vid and stay tuned. Again, thank you guys for watching. So I just want to do a quick little voiceover talking about progress. Cause that's all we want, right? So this is footage from last week, if you guys remember, um, from last Sunday, uh, my leg hyper day. So both on my strength day and on my hyper day, I still like to progress um, with strength. So I always track all my weights. So this week I decided to keep the same weight because uh, my intensity and my RP was pretty darn high. And uh, so in my eyes, progress can be using the same amount of weight um, but having better form, it's seeming easier, and more or less kind of mastering the weight. I like to do that um, for most of my compound lifts, just to be safe. And so this is footage from today, my squat session. So I like to always videotape my first and last set. So this is actually just my last set, and I just didn't want to make the video too long, so I just did the last seven reps on each lift. So. As you guys can see, it seems a lot easier just based off of my facial expression, but um, it felt a lot better too. I mean, the 10 sets I don't think are ever gonna be easy, or the, not 10 sets, the 10 reps for three sets is never really gonna be easy, but slowly progressing and you know adding some weight to the bar. So I think now next week I might try to add a little bit more weight, even though this one was pretty hard. And also doing the same thing um, for deadlifts. Um, so as you can see, this is footage again from last week, and then I'll show you guys footage um, next from this week. Um, so as I tell my clients and a lot of people that always hit me up on Instagram or on Facebook or social media, they go, oh, how do you always progress? You know, um, and I, I always try to tell them, you know, I'm not always adding weight to the bar. And as you guys can see, I'm nothing impressive, but I do like to monitor progress through, um, you know, like I said before, speed, form, if I can recover well, and then I like to master lift um, more or less before I kind of increase, um, especially on my compound lifts. Um, so, and also one thing you guys should always remember is not every single session you're gonna have perfect ones. So I always like to look at, you know, your weekly progress, monthly and even yearly, so one workout might not, um, you might think that's all oh, the worst, but you know, one workout during the week or that's one workout in a whole month or a whole year, it's not that big of a deal. Um, so stay consistent, staying positive. And that's, that's another reason why I like to, you know, monitor different things. So, oh, I can't, I couldn't do enough weight, but you know what, my form war is looking much better here today. But that being said, you gotta be also be honest with yourself because don't use that as an excuse to kind of, you know, drop off or just always lower the weight. Um, sometimes you just gotta suck it up and get through it. And so uh, this again, the sets of ten or the sets of rep. My, what am I talking about? The reps of ten are always a struggle for me. So they're getting a little bit better, and I'm still adding up, adding more weight on the bar, which is good. But uh, these last few reps are pretty bad but anyways thank you again for watching uh, be sure to like share and subscribe and uh thank you thank you again for watching peace